Praise the Lord. Just I want to sing one song. Before that, I want to pray for everybody. The people are walking here. Before I start to pray this gospel, the name of Jesus Christ is above all the names. Pray the Lord. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray for everybody. God bless you. <laughs> That's what they come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Devil will say, don't God. God is giving eternal. Okay. God bless you. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray for everybody, especially the people are walking here. The people are hearing this word of God. I pray for everybody, those who are in this city center. I pray for them. Thank you for touching everybody's heart and mind and body as well. During the time of sharing this word of God, thank you for your doing the healing and wonderful work from heaven. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Praise the Lord. God bless you. So today, before I start to read this gospel, I want to sing one song right now. When I am singing this song, our God's power it will come to you. Praise the Lord. Bless the Lord, oh my soul. Oh my soul. And worship His holy name. Sing like never before. is Lord in me. The sad times of 
salvation to every people. Today morning when I came here, one of the brothers, he was saying to me, God is an energy. He is not believing the religion. He was saying accordingly to me. I said, that is correct. God is energy and power. His power will be executing through the people, those who are believing in Him. But the people are hearing this word of God. in this world. What is evil power? One is a heavenly power. God bless you. The 
even power and God's power can deserve only the children of God. Praise the Lord. The evil power and God's power can deserve all the people, those who are believing in Him, this kind of people only can come to know the evil spirit power. That is what the Bible says. Those who are in Christ Jesus, you are the new creation. What is the meaning of new creation? Each and every people You are living in this world. Your birth is in this world. Because of this is the plan of Jesus Christ through you. All the people are living in this world. Eight billion people are living in this world. Your birth is not at all accidentally in this world. Each and every people are living in this world. Our God has given you a new life in this world. That God's name is Jesus Christ. The minimum way to go to the heaven. That each and every people, you should get work again. Work again is a minimum way you can go to the heaven. the Lord. But majority of the people are not at all aware about this system. Bible says as many as received that Jesus Christ is their Lord and Savior. Our God has given a right, a power to become the children of God in their life. I believe Jesus Christ is their Lord and Savior. Bible says, you all are the children of God. Praise the Lord. All the people are walking here. This is the only one life our God has given to you. Beautiful life to serve the Lord in this world. Jesus Christ said, I am the light of the world. When I pray to this gospel, as I said before, there are two kinds of light in this world. The true light is from Jesus Christ. Most of the people are worshipping the sun, that is a light. The moon, that is a light. No. The creator of the world is different. Our God is created.
created all the sun, sun and moon and all the creatures in this world. Jesus. All the people are working here. By our effort, we are not at all worthy to go to the heaven. By our effort, we are not at all worthy to receive the eternal. Very well, you're 
situation. But today, God is asking to each and every people, are you ready to surrender your life to Jesus? Are you ready? Yeah, I do. I've got the Bible. If you are surrendering your life to Jesus Christ, Of the death. 
Tony. Only Jesus Christ can give you a joyful heart. This is what I want to say according to the gospel to everybody. Gospel John. Chapter 14, where just one Bible says. I want to say to each and every people, the people are walking. The world will say lots of things by the wicked people. Bible says the people, those who are believing that Jesus Christ is your Lord and Savior. Bible says you are the children of God and you are the righteousness of the Lord. If you are the righteousness of the Lord, according to the Bible, you all are the Holy people. to everybody. Jesus Christ said, I am the shepherd, you are the sheep. Bible says, those who are in Christ Jesus, our God is saying, I will send the protection from my heavenly angels to each and every people. If we are the sheep, if I want to say, take care of your life today. Not that you worry anything about your situation. Our God is for each and every member. Thank you. So today, Bible says only one thing to each and every people. Those who are in Christ Jesus, there is no condemnation for them. You don't say amen. You are losing your eternal. Yeah, you say, yeah, I mean, okay. Okay, okay. You have to be God bless you. Jesus Christ also. Praise the Lord. Bible says, those who are in Christ Jesus, there is no condemnation for them. Yes. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Like today, people are walking here. People are walking this place. Please keep this distance. Praise the Lord. That's what I want to say. Please keep little bit distance and walk. I don't want to hurt anybody's body because I'm preaching the gospel. Praise the Lord. I want to say once again more to each and every people. Book of Romans chapter 8, Bible says, those who are in Christ Jesus, Bible says, there is no condemnation for them. What 
In other ways, there will be a condemnation for each and every people, those who are not believing that Jesus Christ is their Lord and Savior. Lots of people are walking here. Only one thing, I got the gospel. Today, I want to say, in Jesus Christ, there is a victory in your life. We all are the victorious people in Christ Jesus. I born again and battered. I myself can to know that Jesus Christ is my Lord and Savior in the year of 2030. And today on makes 2017, I start to preach this gospel in the citizen. As I said before, ten people got baptized from the citizen. The majority of the people, they were the harmless people. They got a new life. How it happened like that? Because Jesus Christ was loving them. Before I finish this session today, I want to encourage to each and every people after the gospel that Jesus Christ is a loving God. I want to say to each and every people in Jesus Christ, there will be a glorious life to each and every people. There will be a prosecution. There will be a rejection. There will be a lot of things it will happen in your life. But Bible says, those who are in Christ Jesus, from the Psalms chapter 91, Bible says, our God is saying, I will send my heavenly angels to get the protection to each and every people. I'm preaching the God who can protect your life. By the Lord, that day, before I finish this session, I want to ask to each and every people, Jesus Christ is an loving God. No matter the situation which you are facing in your life. But this is a matter. If you are turning not, if you are not turning back to the Lord, you cannot be able to overcome the things which is coming against your life.
So each and every people, this is a wonderful time. Glory is time. Our God is granting to each and every people to receive the salvation in your life from today on. Let you know. That is what Bible says. Today is a day of your salvation, not tomorrow. Not today, but tomorrow. Bible says, today is a day of your salvation. Praise the Lord. Today, before I finish this session, I want to say to each and every people, this is a God of life. Only one life which our God has given to all the people. To worship, to say thanks, whatever God has done in your life, to the Lord. Can I pray for you? Can I pray for you? I can pray for you. You want to pray? How many number of people are no more in this world? In the year of 2020, 2021, there was a pandemic. But all the percentage of people are here from the Lord. Saturday, I want to say, Jesus Christ's name is a wonderful and powerful. His name can get salvation to each and every people. Praise the Lord. Before my closing session, I want to pray for each and every people that Jesus Christ is loving each and every people. Because of this reason, I am praying to each and every people. Heavenly Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray for everybody, those who are walking here, those who are here in this world. Heavenly Father, I pray for them. Thank you for your touching each and everybody's heart and mind. Thank you for your serving in the power of the Holy Spirit to each and every people's heart. So that, thank you for your raising us. Lots of evangelists, lots of preachers from the city to the nations. Thank you for your giving. Lots of soul for the baptism in the era of 2020. Heavenly Father, once again more, I pray for each one of you. In Jesus' name. I pray for all the people who are watching online. Spiritually, in all the areas, I bless each and every people. In Jesus' name, I pray. You want to say, Amen? Praise the Lord. So, the people are walking here. This is only one time, one life, our God is given to you to serve His name. To serve the God in our life. So may our God bless you, everybody, in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Thank you very much. Okay. Today we have meeting. Today, 3.30 p.m. UK time. And Indian time, 9 p.m. US time. At 10.30 a.m. We have meeting. South Africa time, 5.30 p.m. Praise the Lord. We have meeting, revival meeting, in English and Hindi. Please join the revival meeting. May God bless you more and more.